I usually don't post stuff like this, but here y'all go. Oh, hell no. Nah. Here are five times when cops realized their colleague was a secret pedo. Starting with the case of this former cop who traveled a great distance to take advantage of a 14 year old. However, instead of his anticipated outcome, he would be greeted by the father of the child and a mob of police officers. You ever leave? Do something about it, you. Come out here. Here, grab your gun. Really? Oh, you're a cop? You're a, you're a police officer? And you're, you're a fing police officer? You're a fing police officer, you scumbag? Days prior, the man had begun messaging an alleged 14 year old, but could have never expected that this supposed 14 year old was actually the father of the child. The man also somehow thought flashing his police badge would save him, but he was terribly wrong. I'm gonna call your boss. 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 I wasn't going to. You wanna call your boss before I do? Do you wanna call your boss before I do? And go ahead, erase it all, buddy. Erase it all. Erase it all. You guys see it? Erasing it. He's erasing it. Erase it all. I'm video wherever the fuck I want to. Do something about it, you. Do something about you. You have a release? Do something about it, you. Come out here. Here, grab your gun. Really? Oh, you're a cop? You're a police officer? Realizing there was no escape route, he attempted to defend his disgraceful actions by fabricating false stories. But considering that the father had all the chat logs, the man was only making things worse for himself. You think I'm stupid? I knew you were a cop. How's this going to look? How's this going to look to your department? Look when there's proof that you're harassing my brother for money. Your brother for money? He's got a video too. There's a person videoing him too. Oh, somebody's videoing your brother? I don't know who your brother is, but you're a cop? They know you. You're a cop? What department do you work for? I'm going to calm down. What department do you work for? Well, they know you and you're videoing What, him what department do you work for? I would never ask for money. Well, never, never, never. Asking it for money. I would never do it. I would never do Same it. Camera set up and everything. Okay, well, that's fine. It's not me. There's a whole bunch of us out there. What what department do you work for? I'm coming down. What police department do you work for? I work for one here. I know, but what, what police department? What county is it? It's not here. Okay, what county? It's I already knew you were Texas. a cop in Texas. So why are you here? Because I live here. Okay, so you're a cop in Texas, but you live here? Do you know the Texas Rangers just took fucking a couple guys in in Texas for me? I knew you were a cop. I knew you were a cop before you pulled up. You think I'm stupid. I do my research. I knew you were a cop. Why do you think I asked you several times? I knew you were a cop. Bro, you're out there supposed to serve and protect, right? You're not supposed to serve the fucking children, right? So you're a fucking cop, bro. You just said I'm harassing an officer. You showed me your badge. You're a fucking cop, bro. What are you doing, man? What are you doing? Don't you think the cops got enough on their plate already? Don't you? Can we agree that they already get enough? But then you got people out like out there like you trying to meet with the children? It makes them look bad, bro. Just like that other guy that's asking your brother for money makes me look bad, right? Right? But if I asked you for a penny, I asked you to call your mom to get some help, man. Right? I didn't ask you for money. You got it, sir. You got it. He said he has a problem. He's like minors for four or five years. Um, is this your address? Yeah, or? yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that one right there. That, yep. Well, that's your house. That's my house. Okay. Um, but anyways, um, then we were talking Well, his mom. Somebody must have called him because I live streamed this. And uh, he went to his truck. He was going to drive off. I told him I was calling the police and he pulled his badge out of the center console. And he's like, you're harassing an officer of the law. Pulled his police badge out on him. He told me he was a cop. Um, told me he was a security guard at first, but yeah, right now he just pulled out his badge at the center console and he's like, you're harassing a cop. He's like, back the fuck up. Got it all recorded where he said he was here to have sex with a 14 year old. Okay. Um, I got all the chat logs right here. I have one more phone right in there. I can grab it for you. It's the first like six where, where he says he's 14, where I say I'm 14 and he's okay with it. And then Wait, this- You have one more phone? You have another, well, it's another phone. It's a grinder. It's my grinder uh, decoy phone. So okay. that's how we met. But as soon as I told him I was 14, he wanted to get out of uh, Grinder. He wanted to go to regular messaging because he didn't want Grinder keeps record. Okay. So he was trying to go to messaging. So we went over to messaging, and that's what I have on this phone. So you're going to see on here. This is where he asks 
And what's the paper? Um, that's just what he said. I just write it down so when I'm talking to him, yeah, and you can have it all. You sure oh, you can. don't need this? No, not at all. That was just the, the big points that I'm writing down. Hey, how are you? After the police had collected the man's statement, this part-time fake cop slash full-time pedo was finally detained and taken to jail to face multiple charges and is currently awaiting trial. But if you thought he was bad, then you haven't met 34-year-old Detective Robert Strand, who on June the 19th of 2022 would be discovered to be in possession of some very illegal videos on his mobile phone. Mr. Strand, go ahead and step out here. So we're going to do this officer is going to switch out the cuffs. You're sending out rewards and payouts, but it's a struggle to do it right. Multiple vendors, multiple... And then we will uh, go ahead and take your holster and step off. While on duty, Robert had no idea that an arrest warrant had been issued against him. And by the time he had found out, he was already cuffed and immediately began denying the allegations. God bless you, Spice How you doing? Hey. Sir, can I have you do me a favor? Sit your paperwork on the tailgate right there. Go ahead and place your hands behind your back for me. Go ahead and relax your legs. Judging by the officer's tone, it appeared they wanted the case to be as discreet as possible due to Robert's rank in the force. This is unfortunate to see, as nobody, especially someone like him, deserves any special treatment. Okay, Robert, I'm going to let Special Agent Owen Pena tell you why you're being on place under arrest at this time. You're being placed under arrest where we'll be getting an arrest warrant for you, sworn out today for our possession our possession of, as of a child of a of children possession statute okay the biggest thing for me is i do this for everybody i don't want a big scene made about anything so i'm going to be as discreet as possible cooperate with me we'll be fine um, let's get this portion done and do what we gotta do Yes, sir. 